It's recital time and I'm going to teach you how to do a basic smoky eye for Major School of Dance 2016 recital. First of all, eye primer is a must all over the eyelid for a smoky eye. Begin with a crease brush. This is a brush that comes to a point. You're going to begin with the darker color all over the lid from the lash line up into the crease. Don't worry about the lines being neat at this point and you want to blend it and evenly coat the eye. Next apply a darker blue shade over the top of that and continue to blend until you get the depth you want. You want to apply a black color over the blue to give the eye dimension and depth and begin your smoky look. Use a brush to get your lines so that you don't go outside either corner of the eye. Continue to blend to get the depth and color that you want. Next use a liquid foundation brush or a stiff brush to do some cleanup and get any fallout. Next brush you will use is a blending brush or a softer brush. You're going to use a neutral brown or a skin tone color like a beige or cream and you're going to use this color with your blending brush to soften the line between the crease and the neutral color. I use a new blending brush but you can use the same one. Use a creamy shimmering highlight color, not white but a creamy and use it right underneath the brow bone and on the inside corner of the eye. The inside corner of the eye is very important and you want to blend in toward the smoky color. Then blend from the outside in. Next you want to use a matte color all over the entire eye and this is what gives the smoky appearance. It's a creamy and you're going to blend it all over continuing under the corner of the eye. Go back to the crease brush. It's the same black or charcoal color and begin on the outside corner of the eye blending inward toward about the center of the eye. Go over the smoky matte color to continue to add the depth and dimension that you want and blend well. Always use a dark brown liner to begin. Begin at the outside corner of the eye, blending inward underneath the eye. Small eyes should stop halfway, large eyes can go all the way to the corner. However, everyone should do a thicker line across the top lash line and go all the way to the corner. Be sure this line is visible. Next, I use a black gel liner and I apply it only on the outside corner and then across the top lash line. If you're applying false lashes, it's important to always do your eyeliner first. You want your gel line to be close to the lash line and you can add as much thickness as you would use like. Use a smudger brush in your black charcoal color and apply it over the lower lash line. If applying false lashes, do those first and then apply the charcoal over the lashes. If no lashes, go ahead and apply over the liner. Apply false lashes now or on natural lashes, begin with a lash primer. You want to apply two coats of lash primer letting it dry. Then begin with mascara. I love Mary Kay's Lash Intensity Mascara because it gives a falsified look with no building fibers. I apply one coat first on the top, then the bottom, letting it dry in between. You can then layer it and apply two, three, even four or five coats until you get the depth, dimension, length, and thickness that you want. It's recital time. We're all tired. So use an under eye corrector in peach to hide those bags and lines, puffiness, and dark circles under the eye area. Pat with a finger and blend. And voila, there's your MSOD 2016 Smoky Eye.